China's latest generation carrier rocket, the Long March 7, is set for its maiden launch. On Wednesday morning, the Long March 7 carrier rocket was vertically transported to its launch pad at the Wenchang Satellite Launch Center in South China's Hainan province. CCTV's Yu Lei was at the site. She brings us more. Moving to the final phase of its preparation, the Long March 7 carrier rocket is now in the process of vertical transportation. Since the rocket arrived here in the middle of May, staff members have been assembling parts and conducting tests. In the next few days, we'll continue the final check on the whole system to guarantee each channel runs well. During the launching process, we will also monitor all the environmental data to provide a reference for future rockets. Wenchang Satellite Launch Center is the newest and the only coastal launch center in China. After finishing construction in 2014, the Long March 7 carrier rocket launch will be its first mission. The Long March 7 rocket and its payload is now carried on a mobile launch platform where it will be moved from the assembly building to the launch pad. They are 2,800 meters away from each other and may not seem so far apart. But moving a multi-ton rocket on the rail track is never an easy task. The entire moving process took about three hours. When the launch vehicle arrives at the launch pad, rotating platforms on the two sides of the tower are swung around it to allow for fueling and final checks. Today's vertical transportation went very well. In the next few days, we will enter the final fueling and launching process according to the weather conditions. The rocket uses liquid propellant, which makes it more environmentally friendly than previous modules. The Long March 7 is expected to be launched at an appropriate time between June the 25th and June the 29th. It will transport cargo for China's planned space station and is expected to become the main carrier for future space launches. Wu Lei, CCTV at Wenchang Satellite Launch Center. Now, the Long March 7 launch commander, Wang Guangyi, is responsible for making sure everything goes smoothly and according to plan. CCTV's Wu Lei had the chance to talk with him at the Wenchang Launch Center in Hainan. Launch Commander Wang, what exactly is your job and how important is your duty in the final launch? My job is to give orders during the whole launch process. I will command all the departments from fueling to the final launch. We have 17 systems in total, including the rocket system, the launch pad system, and the payload system. A successful launch will require precise coordination of all the systems in accordance with the planned procedures. What's the most challenging part of your job and how do you overcome those difficulties? The most difficult part is the coordination. If any part is not handled well, it may lead to unexpected results. For example, poor coordination could lead to equipment being damaged, so I have to keep learning and familiarizing myself with all the systems. As the launch commander, you have to know everything. If you don't know something, people could lose confidence in your position. Are you nervous for being the launch commander for the first time? It would be impossible to say that I am not, but I think I am psychologically prepared. I work in sleep as planned. I try not to think too much. I go to the beach to relieve pressure. Taking walks makes me feel better. Can you share with us your feeling on the launching of this new generation Long March 7 rocket? This will be different from previous launches. We are using a new launch center and a new generation rocket. It is a big challenge for us. The mission will test the entire launch center and the rocket's capacity. Everyone is watching.
Well, now let's talk to CCTV's Wu Lei, who joins us live from China's Hainan province with the latest on the launch of the Long March 7. Uh, Wu, just give us an idea of how the final preparations for the Long March 7 carrier rocket launch are going. Um, how are the weather conditions there and are they suitable for liftoff? Well, here I'm now standing at the uh, from 400 meters away from the latch launch pad of the Wenchang Satellite Launch Center in Hainan Province. And behind me is uh, the Superstar Long March 7 carrier rocket. It's uh, one of China's latest generation carrier rockets. And now, as we can see, that the top uh, rotating platform of the launch pad has opened. That shows that uh, the launch has entered the final stage. And the experts told us that uh, the fueling process was completed this afternoon, which means the rocket can be launched at any time. And so we are still waiting for the final launch. And uh, so uh, during the past few days, the weather forecasters casters have been paying close attention to the weather conditions. Because this morning, and uh, we can see that it was still very rainy and shower. But now, as you can see, you can tell the weather can be turning better and it's clear and cloudy. And so the weather forecasters will be closely monitoring the weather condition to decide when the rocket will be launched. Back to you. Uh, and we're, of course, we, as you mentioned, weather one of the challenges in a rocket launch of this nature. Um, what are some of the other challenges that uh, the team there is facing? And just how important is this rocket launch? Well, indeed, experts told us that there are many challenges for this launch and uh, because this Wenchang Satellite Launch Center is China's newest and the only coastal launch center and uh, because it was uh, the lowest latitude and uh, also this mission is its first mission and also it's a new rocket. Long March 7 carry rocket is uh, China's uh, latest generation rocket. It uses uh, new technology and also liquid uh, propellant. Uh, it has taken researchers eight years to develop this uh, uh, medium-sized uh, rocket. Uh, and uh, so the experts told us that there are many first times for these engineers and experts. Uh, but also there, are, there will be more uh, many breakthroughs uh, to be made uh, at the same time. And uh, the rocket will carry uh, up to 13.5 tons to low Earth orbit. And this time the rocket will carry six experimental payloads into space for further aerospace uh, experiments. And uh, the, uh, so the experts told us that uh, uh, the launch of the Long March 7 will be of great significance as it will usher China's space launch mission because the Long March 7 rocket will be the main carrier for China's future space launches. Back to you. Thanks very much, Wu Lei. Keeping a close eye there for us uh, on those developments in Hainan and that very exciting rocket launch.